We learned about the animals living there and the plants growing and how to preserve it, leave no trace. Another experience was using binoculars. I like using those to like see different animals like from a far distance. And like we saw the a great blue heron one day and it was really cool because you like I don't think people see those a lot. My favorite thing was when these two women came and we, they had collected samples from the creek and we looked at them under a microscope and we just saw, well, basically what they were made of and it was really interesting. My favorite activity was measuring um, the temperature of like my body and the animals around me. We were measuring the temperature to see like how certain animals like they like to go and hide out in the shade, and, yeah, and to just see how like hot the floor can get in the Bayona wetlands. We had a good time with learning about some plants, how there was some, we found some plants that had berries in the outside. If you like tasted it, it would be sour. One day we went hiking and we did a trash pickup because there were a lot of animals out there and we learned that we don't want them to eat the trash. And I think this was a perfect experience for me to explore and learn more about animals and the nature. I made new friends. My time in the wetlands was fun. Because my friends, like, they think it's, like, really boring to be outdoors and to learn about nature and, like, being here. I kind of used to think that until I came here and it's, like, it was really fun. The fun about being outside is that you get to be outside, you get to experience it, and you can see it. You can, like, it's hands-on, and you also get to learn about it. The Bayona wetlands is a very great place and we need to preserve it. It's vital to the environment. <laughs>